He's up. He has the look of defeat on his face. A bewildered look. Let's see if Anthony Joshua can destroy oh! Bumps. Oh my goodness, we're oh. back again. Man, shout out to y'all, man. Thank you for liking, commenting, subscribing. Yes. Keep it going, man. We we just hit 60 subscribers. That's crazy for us so far. I mean, we only we only uh about seven episodes in, so we appreciate y'all. Keep it going. Yes. Man, today oh, we're yeah. back with uh the Red Cups, as you can see, man. Shout out to y'all hey. for leaving it in the comments. Y'all letting us know that, hey, this is what y'all want to see. So this is what we're going to continue to do. Shout out to y'all. Now, as you can see, of course, the usual suspects are here. My brother Tony, my brother Ev. Yes, sir. But we have a special guest, as you can see, next uh, to yes, me. Who yes. is he? Who is he? Who, the who infamous. Is he? Who is he, right? <laughs> the now, infamous. Now, he's yes, coming yes. to us from the We Run Detroit Boxing Show yes. by way of the Press for Conversation podcast, right, man. So right. he's he's doing this thing on YouTube. He's been doing this thing for a while. He's had conversations with the likes of world champion and Detroit legend Tony Harrison. He's right. had conversations right. with the likes of undisputed women's champion Alicia Baumgartner. That's right, sir. We want to bring to you. Our our other brother over here, man. Oh, we yeah. appreciate you looking out for us too, man. Corey, man. What's Lay what's back, up, Corey, man. man. What's up, man? Oh, man. Coming up here, what's what's up, man? How you, brother? What's up? What's up? What's up, man? Now, of course, you know we want you to tell us, you know, a little bit about what you've been doing, man. Just just to, uh, you know, obviously let our mm. our uh, subscribers and things know, and also tell us what you got coming up, bro. What's uh, going man. on? I've been doing uh, the radio thing for a while. I'm a radio personality, of course, you know. I'm a YouTube podcaster, and I had the, the blessing to interview my man Tone right here. Man, make sure y'all check his music out. It's pretty hot. And um, <clears throat> I got to rerun Detroit Boxing. So I think Detroit Boxing needs to be heard more. I think it's – it's a lot of people say it's great. It's a graveyard. It's not fair because a lot of a lot of promoters and a lot of managers don't give our city a chance. They just go off what happened in the past. What? You know, they should give us – the president is there. You just got to come here and visit. You know what I'm saying? Don't just look on the outside and say, oh, he joined in. You have to really come to the city. You really right. got some nice fighters, man, that's coming. That's right. You know, but they have to get on the opportunity. You know, the zone coming, need to come here. Golden Boy need to come here. Top rank. No one's coming here, and that's not fair. You know what I'm saying? We got the, we got nice stadium. The Lions just had a great season. Y'all can do something at four season. Shout out. I yeah. did something at Little Caesars Arena. But, you know, that was great. Yeah. We got all type. We got the, the, the uh, what's the little, like I said, the little season arena, right? Yeah. yeah. So we, you know, we got places around here y'all can do it. I, I just need the promoters and Sound fighters. Board. And that's why I'm glad this show right here, Fisher Cups and Bucks, is a great show because boxers need to be heard. Yes. And, yes. and a lot of people need to learn about boxing. You know, a lot of people be misconstrued about boxing. They yeah. just think, you know, such, such, a, it's more than that, you know. Because I tell people when you turn professional, it's about dollars and cents. Make Facts. mine so Facts. Yeah. you know you of course you want to fight everybody a fighting force will fight everybody but you want to do what makes sense so right. I agree hey right. man well Same. said for sure mm -hmm. and um you know we appreciate you coming up oh, for sure. you know what I'm saying appreciate for sure, having man. Me, man and we we definitely recognize what you've done already in the in the boxing community oh, yeah. especially sure. you know on the Detroit scene right uh, you oh, know man, so yeah. so thank you so much for that man but. Man, let's get into it, man. As you guys seen when we came in, crazy knockout. Anthony oh, Joshua versus, versus Francis Nagano. What a devastating knockout, man. I devastating. think this might have been the, the most crazy knockout I've seen probably in a minute, man. He put him flat on his, you know what. And, <laughs> but what, what y'all take away from that, man? A lot of people are super excited about Anthony Joshua get, getting that knock, excuse me, getting that knockout. Um, they saying he's back. You know what I mean? Oh, I mean, we man, come on. we a little more knowledgeable, man. man. But so, so I want to obviously get y'all take on that, man. Like, what do y'all think? Is Anthony Joshua is he back? I mean, is is he what Eddie Hearn said? Eddie Hearn said he, he nobody can beat him. I mean, even though we just saw him <laughs> man, get beat Hearn, by Usyk man, twice, yeah. but but what what do you guys think about? First that, of man? all, <laughs> I'm gonna let you go ahead because Cap. 
<laughs> I, I don't know what Eddie Stop talking about, cap. man. Eddie, just, shout cap. out Eddie, man. Eddie just being Eddie, but shout out to Eddie, <laughs> yes, man. man. Um, Eddie Murphy, that's what you should call. I'm gonna let my, oh, <laughs> I'm cap. gonna let my guy Eb take this one off, man. I'll follow up, man. No, nah, um, hey, listen, shout out to Eddie Hearn. He's right. Ain't nobody seeing AJ right now. Shout out to AJ. Mm. I had you all the way, AJ. He I did. told him. I told the people. I was shouting from the, from the top to the top. I said, hey, AJ going to win this. What? AJ got this. What? It's over. He and absolutely what he do? was not that he hype. He in there. He wasn't or that he, short. I was just hyped just like that, AJ. <laughs> Come on the show. I'm going to be hyped just like this. I, he went in there. You went in there, AJ. You got it done. You loaded with that right, right hand. Like I said, right. it was no, you know what I think? I think right. it was no element of surprise yeah. um, with, with Nagano. And so... I think Nagano needed more time to to even you know get Mixy and figure figure him out. Yeah. Um. So with it being no element of surprise with, with Nagano and AJ being the boxer he is, uh, technically sound defense, bigger guy. Um. He went in there and it, it as you can see, it's it's that simple, man. You know, it's that simple, man. So I was about to say something on the lines of. It don't matter. Anyways, AJ is that simple. He went and got it done. And okay. hey. Set him up for that for that knockout and got it done, man. All right, man. You was right. Yeah, I was I'll right. I'll be the first to admit I was punch drunk, man. Shout out to uh, Anthony Joshua uh, for doing what we've been waiting to see him do for so long, man. Also, shout out to Francis what? Nagano, um, who, you know, came to the sport of boxing, man, made great money, fought two of the best heavyweights that's actively, you know, reigning in the division right now, man. And, it, I mean, it was a – he went down three times in two rounds. So, I mean, after the first two rounds, me and Bouye was actually texting each other while the knockout was happening. I told him, yes. I'm like, he, he's about to go down. Right. right when he was typing back, he got he got stopped, <laughs> man. It was like the way he was breathing, his posture, the way he was opening himself up for those shots, man. I just knew Anthony Joshua, though, not to take nothing from the fact that uh, Nagano actually is a UFC fighter, MMA fighter, but, yeah. you know, much respect to him for coming to the sport of boxing, man. And, you know, those kind of mistakes are likely to happen when you training for a certain style of fighting and then you get in there with a fighter that's training for a, a specific style of fighting. He put on a performance that we expected him to put on, man, and it was it was a good knockdown. He showed a good attribute. He, I mean, I, I can't say – I'm assuming he was in shape ju- judging by, you know, the way he looked in the ring, but, I mean, yeah. the fight lasted – um, t- four minutes, man. So you really can't say. Yeah. But as far as what's next for the guy, man, who knows? I, I won't just take this fight and say, man, Anthony Joshua was just next to the top, anyway, whatever, whatever. Even though I want to say that, but not to take nothing away from this performance, man. Shout out to AJ. Great yeah. performance. Great knockout. Big knockout, man. And we excited because he, he up there with the uh, the rest of the best of the heavyweights, man. So hell of a knockout. And hey. Where we go from here, we don't know, man. You got to show us. You got to keep showing us because you really got to make us believers at this point, man. Because, I mean, Facts. those two fights against Usyk, we got to do something about that. We got to see about that, AJ, man. But I'll take, I'll take what you gave us, man. Great performance, man. What you got you for us, Corey? What you got for us, Corey? Huh? Y'all know y'all wrong. <laughs> oh, y'all know man. y'all wrong. I'm about, to get on, I'm about to get on him right now. Anthony Joshua put me in the mindset of Keith Thurman. Let me tell you why. Oh. He I got to hear this. He, he, he ducked. He ducked. Tyson Fury and Deontay Wilder too long. They put on three fights. What? Three fights. Three fights. It took him a long time. Now he's desperate because now, of course, he needed this fight. What? He needed, of course, and got a shot to him making 20 million. He made 20 million. Second fight in boxing. But it, it, this is not, this is the point with Anthony Joshua. He's not, he, how can we call him the best? How's the best? He hasn't fought. Tyson Fury. We ain't calling the best. Nah, we ain't calling him the best. Oh, Eddie, 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 okay, okay. But we say he ready for the best. We. <laughs> you got to say he. My bad, my bad. My bad. My bad. He ready Eddie for the best. Go ahead, though. I got Eddie you. Like Eddie not, Hearn. How can we put him in there with the best? He's never been. He only been unified champion. He never been undisputed. How can we put him in there? And then he, he wasn't even going to fight him. You got to sell his fighting. You got to sell his fighting. He, he got to sell his fighting. Has to. I get it. I get it. I get it. Has to. I get it, but it's yeah. like why, like not well, like you said. What's next? You should probably not even gonna fight him for, for what? If, I mean, Tyson Fury might fight. Facts. Yeah, you should beat him twice. I mean, and then not only that is, well, it took you, you y'all you and Deontay Wilder could have fought just recently. He didn't even have to fight Joshua Joseph Park. Y'all could have fought each other inside of Arabia. Well, 
you know, I mean, I, I, I get the reason the Nagano fight will happen over the Wilder fight is because he put on a great, you, you know, if you go, if you're going to pick up a loser, then it's like, hey, why not take the path of least mm-hmm. resistance for right. one? Because right. you, because mm-hmm. Deontay Wilder is certified as a, mm-hmm. as a fighter, I you know agree. what I'm saying? And, and he, and you know, he might, there's a chance he might train harder for a fight like Anthony Joshua that he been won for mm-hmm. years, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. Versus a Joseph Parker. He don't give a, right. you know what I mean? And I, I agree no. with what you said earlier. Shout out, like I said, AJ, you did a great job. Yeah. Now, there's no there's no excuse. You just yeah. you just had a heck of a great performance. There's no excuse why you shouldn't, even why, even though Wilder took the loss. But there's no excuse why you can't fight him or Tyson Fury or if you should want to fight you again. There's no excuse now. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with that, actually. You know, I mean, you know, when it comes to Anthony Joshua, it was tough, right? Because, mm-hmm. you know, this leads us to uh, our next thing, right? We're, unfortunately, in the punch drunk category. <laughs> you know, I mean, geez, Louise. I mean, the, that's why. Can you, you know, blame us, though? Can I you mean, blame, can you blame us, though? Yes. weird UFC. I can blame you guys. <laughs> you should have known. fights, man. Stick I with hate the boxes. Yeah, they weird to I'm, call, I'm man. Mad. Yeah, and Anthony Joshua didn't let me down before. You so feel it's, me? Yep. Like, But so I knew you wasn't going to let us down this time, guys. Well, right, I'll take it. Great, great job. job. Yeah, great I, prediction, I, man. He made me so proud, man. Great prediction. He really did make me proud, man. The fans. I had no business. I had no business being that Sure, that yeah. fight going the way that I that I assumed right. it would go. Same, I, same. I'm with you. Are you, are you yeah. also feeling that way? Because he gave, like he I'm said, not. Right, I don't see? think that I am. Yeah, I yeah. mean, what the? But only, I mean, only reason I feel like y'all were wrong is because y'all gonna go against the boxer to choose the UFC guy. Yeah, I would, that yeah. really threw me off. Man, but I just let y'all go down hey, that road. Yeah. Those, those yeah. big shots in the heavyweight I division, agree. man, can change the tide of a fight in a in a millisecond. I agree. You know, and, and, and not to mention, that. we just seen yeah. Tyson Fury go down, man. Yeah. This is, but this is the problem with, with Tyson yeah. Fury is that he plays to the level of – he boxes to the level of his opponents, man. I agree. <laughs> I, I do I agree. agree with that. Because you know? when he fought Otto Wileen, Wileen was getting with him, and, and bro, like, it's no way he can he should be able to uh, compete with Tyson Fury. Exactly. He I, like to get in there and play around, man. I, I, I don't know why Fury does Tyson that. Tyson Fury is a great marketer, man. He, he does stuff on purpose, man. He sold that fight. Yeah, uh, yeah, I agree. So that fight, that fight, that's that's a good point. They could have got a second. They could have got a rematch out of that. It made more, true. way more money. Very true. Yeah, yeah, true. You think you gonna get Anthony Joshua gonna give him a rematch and he whooped him like that? No way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey, Anthony but, Joshua got way more to lose than Francis Ngannou that's too. True. That's a that dual sport true. athlete. That's, 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 that's true. That's so, hey, that's but you know what I love when he when he knocked him out. AJ knocked him out. Then he just like looked at everybody with that Calm, dra- with poise. that Drago look. Like yeah. if he dies, he dies. Hey, no <laughs> yeah. celebrate. That's he, what made it look so devastating, in, bro. Like they, and looked, they got him in like one of the coldest shots ever, bro. Bro. Man, After the knockout, bro, we got to so, show that we're gonna probably yeah, okay. throw it right yeah. up here. But you know what? Like you said, I'm surprised we even discussing the heavyweight division because that heavyweight division been so down down for so long. I agree. It has. We right. talked about that yesterday in our meeting. But, but you know what? They, yeah. What about the young dog? We don't get too off subject. What about the young dog, Jerry Anderson? Is they mm. gonna get him a shot? Well, he. Uh, I don't think he's ready. Yeah, he's not, ready. not quite ready yet. He's not ready. He's not Mentally, ready he shot. already yeah, shown not, that. Yep. Nick, Anthony Joshua, next opponent might be Daniel Dubois. You know what I'm saying? Because Daniel Dubois didn't look good. Anthony you know Joshua, I mean? man, they trying to get him the, the winner of Tyson Fury. Yeah, they want him to big, keep, big money. You know about the fight. You don't think so? No. Nah, keep him busy though. I mean, I mean big no. money. I mean, if if he needs a busy fight, then he's probably gonna fight Wild. I, I was just yeah, about to say that. I agree with you. There you go. Like, That's like, the perfect you gotta one. Think, like these guys are. Towards and the it, end of for their career. some reason, I, it kind of feel like he. Not saying that he feel like that, but. It might seem like he owed Deontay Wilder a favor, man. This could be a favor for a favor. You know, I, 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 great point. I could see him getting in there with Deontay Wilder next because, as far as yes. like uh, the Tyson Fury, and the, the only way I, he's only gonna, the only way I see him fighting Usyk is if Usyk beat Tyson Fury, and he has to go through Usyk to get back to the top, man. You know, because yeah. right now he's still to. not a tier one. Head. But I think we both agree if he looks like how he just looked. You feel me? Like throwing that straight right hand, planting his feet, you know, looking, you know, actually well, throwing using his distance, using his distance everything. Is he, is he, is he gonna then look, he might have a better shot. Is he going to look good with a boxer just like him? I'm talking exactly. about, exactly. That's his I'm talking about in yeah. terms of the fight actually <coughs> happening. That fight is probably not going to happen yeah. unless well, if I'm unless Usyk. Usyk. I already unless beat Usyk beats Tyson Fury, I already beat you twice. There's no sense in me fighting you. Yeah. Now, if I beat Tyson Fury... You have to come see me again. You, there you, you go. Know what I'm saying? It's That's be, how you do it. And that. it won't be the first three fight in history. You know, yeah. it's, it's been four fights. Yeah. So, I mean, it's, it, and it's the, 
the fight gonna happen if the money on the line. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. Most ultimately, the fight is gonna happen if the money's on the line. Oh, the yeah. money that's in the heavyweight division is only circling between the same couple people. So I mean, Anthony Joshua, like I say, Usyk knocks off Tyson Fury, which I don't see that happening. But that's I a conversation for another day. Right. Then yeah, he'll see him again. But yeah, I think ultimately, depending on AJ's next performance, because it's I'm sure it's not gonna be against Tyson Fury. Maybe the fight after that. Yeah, but yeah, nah. it's gonna be against Tyson Fury, man. Yeah, yeah. I, I heard they, so they got a rematch clause, though. I believe. The Fury and uh, Usyk. And I ain't mad yeah. at that. <coughs> yeah, you know, so. it's they, a ty- they probably, uh, yeah, they probably it's should have. Yeah, it's, yeah. It should have a yeah. Tyson Fury. Yeah. I mean, if Tyson sense. Fury beats Usyk one, he's beating him twice, man. I, unless he come back from the dead like he did in the Deontay Wilder fight. Yeah. Then, yeah, I agree. That's that's just a prediction. You know, I'm ready uh, to be punch drunk on that, cat, I, on that fight, too, if it comes I down just, to it. I but. just thought about something, though, bro. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, we're not the only one that's punch drunk here. Uh, you know, we... Yeah, I'm looking down here a little bit past you, Tony, and uh, this guy Ev's punch drunk too. I didn't forget about you, my my guy. Enlighten us, man. I didn't forget about you, my guy. This was this, yeah. This was uh, there, there was another fight. Uh, Jermaine Ortiz oh, with oh, the yeah, Fimo we Lopez. Oh my god! And oh, we talked about that one last time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we talked about. I, that I'm sure that we that didn't talk about that. I don't think we talked about that. Now, to oh, be yes. fair, you know, Jermaine Ortiz put on a good performance, and many argue that. He possibly won the fight. I don't argue that. I don't so does that mean that I'm either. like, nah? You have like, drunk. You like one, you I like, mean, I'm like buzzing, you right? Yeah. I mean, I'm buzzing. He trying to break. He trying to break even. You know how you grow hey, He trying to break even. You know what I'm saying? Did you think he won that fight? Or did you think you won that fight? Um. Or still debatable? Nah, nah. I I think I think To won. Um. He was more aggressive. Only because Jermaine Ortiz wasn't active. Yeah, if he was yeah. more he can't active. can't win a fight with so. inactivity. Oh, yeah. I think T.O. I agree with I that. I think T.O. Right. with that. So, Teofimo Lopez, I, I think he's going to be Matias. Uh, let's, let's talk about that. Matias, oh. they need to fight now. I think that fight could happen. Or I think that fight should I like happen. That. I like that. Or Secure Stevenson just stop crying and go fight Matias in his hometown. He don't want that. Hey. You don't want that. Well, unfortunately, Shakur Stevenson, man, he has, uh, like, Killed his own career. You know what I mean? Shakur oh, Stevenson, he turned down the Devin Haney fight, which I don't understand which why. Is. You're supposed to be a hungry champion. Why wouldn't you take that fight? Facts. Then you turned down the the Frank Martin fight. I, and we're going to talk that, about and, and what do you uh, see Tank now? Right. a little bit later, you know, really coming up. Just but, touch on it a little bit. Oh, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Dude, like, just you touch know, on it a little bit. Well, oh, yeah, 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 let's go right into it. Yeah. Let's go right into it. We oh, might as well. Oh, my God. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> one thing that's been happening, right, is mm-hmm. there's been a lot of, and it's been from casual, casuals, it's been from hardcore boxing pe- fans mm-hmm. or whatever, and, and curators like ourselves, creators, mm-hmm. you know, is Tank the biggest duck in boxing? Is what people have been asking. No, no, you know what I mean. No. I don't think. I mean, what? I think they're they're over the Canelo. I think Canelo's the biggest duck in boxing. Yeah, the biggest Ooh, duck in boxing. Point. How can Tank be the biggest duck and Tank is the cash cow, man? The it's biggest. it's business. He the bit. He the head of the business. He the head of the table. So yeah, he gonna move a little differently than other people. And mind you, now to be fair, to be fair, I Devin Haney. That made me a believer. I can't take that from him. I like what he's doing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, yeah. I appreciate everything he's doing for the sport. Yeah. I, I, my bad. I appreciate everything he's doing for the sport. Right. The 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 point is, it all it always, no matter the sport, no matter the circumstances, no matter the entity, it, it always comes to being the boss, making the decisions, putting people in positions. It's not Tank's fault that he's the boss. Not really. I'm not really saying he's the boss. Like he don't have handlers or he don't have advisors, but he is the cash cow. He's going to move differently than other people are going to move. This yeah. is not the first time we've seen this happen. This is not the last time it's going to happen. That's Do true. I think he's the biggest duck in boxing? No. no. Do I think that he could be doing something a little differently than he's doing to make these fights happen? Absolutely. But I make that judgment call after that Frank. I'm gonna sit this one out after that Frank Martin performance, which I'm. I can I would bet a lot that he's going to win that fight by stoppage going forward. Yeah, if he's inactive for twelve months or eighteen months or something like that, then yeah, okay, I might have a little different analysis on Tank. But right now, this is what happens where you're in a position to call the shots. You're going to move a little what? differently than other people. And Devin Haney, honestly, if we be honest, Tank don't need Devin Haney, and Devin Haney don't need Tank. This is what we want. 
they didn't got in positions where True. they only want them because of because of I because of fans like that. you. But that's the thing that. you saying you don't know about that. It, it's not Bouye's world. It's it's the boxing world. Yeah, so it's that's not Bouye's it's just world. like that's an opinion. It's just my opinion. Yeah. I think they don't need each other. Not to mention they're not in the same weight division, bro. We keep that's sweeping what, that under the at. yeah, like they don't need each other. <laughs> okay, but it helps so much. To the boxing community, to the right. fans, to the world, to the past for fighters, to the future fighters, it means a lot if they do fight each other. That's why you kind of gotta so set aside it, a lot of personal. So you can't say it means a lot, but but they don't need each other. I can't like, say that. that. That's the same thing with. It uh, means with, a lot if you go buy a house, but you but, might not need but, to buy the house. Nah, <laughs> nah I'm telling you, make no sense. It makes because perfect you know sense I'm in the financial world. That don't, that <laughs> that don't, don't mean nothing no that you're in the financial all. world. So hey guys, go buy a house. Don't listen to nothing he talking about. <laughs> no, I'm not it saying all, that. It always makes sense listen. to buy a house. Don't listen now to you, nothing he said. I might have. I probably should have said that. But as it but but as it pertains to this, right? Like they need each other. You know what I mean? Tank. When it's all they don't said, need when, each when other. It, when it's all said and done, they don't need each when other. When it's all said and done, Tank, you cannot retire. They don't need each other, and, and we hear <laughs> they you. do not need each other. We, we hear you, my friend. Sit it. They down. don't need each you. other. <laughs> when it's all, I was fair in my argument. When it, when don't just say they need each other. When it's all said and done, they do not need each other, guys. I'm, I'm when it's, have, when it's all said and done, Tank, are you going to You cannot leave the boxing world without fighting legitimate competition. You, 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 you need, yeah, you need, I agree. Yeah, that's I, a different I, point yeah, of yeah, argument, yeah, though. Yeah. You need to be able to fight a guy like Devin Haney. You need, like Devin Haney. You need so to be able that's to fight in your weight division. You need to be able to fight a guy like Shakur Stevenson. You need to be able to fight a guy, a guy like, like, okay. like that's Loma the point. This, 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 like, it's not this, tanks fought that you, these guys is not getting moved correctly. You need to fight these thing, guys. Though, it has to happen. Like, like he said earlier. No one's going to make money unless they fight Tank. Tank Tank is the cash cow. That's not true. Well, why not? Uh, you don't mm-hmm. think Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney are about to make a bucket load of money? Tank's name is well, not involved in but that. But guess what? Ryan Garcia just fought Tank first. So Tank made that happen. I I, I kind of disagree. Why I with don't that. like having Devin Haney come up in all the <laughs> conversations. <laughs> but he has to. No, he don't. Yes, he, he's Devin he's literally one of the faces of boxing. He has to. Well, right agree. Now, especially, yeah. 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 agree. Yeah. But you keep costing the, points, man. You keep taking the, one point and taking another oh, point and merging oh, them together. You don't like not, to be wrong, bro. Not, you could be wrong. You wrong, bro. Them is declarations, bro. Those are it's declarations that points. you're making. Those are 100 percent declarations. It, it, it comes bro. down to what what it is. Like if you think that that Tank can re- retire tomorrow and, and he's a legendary fighter, then you are a clown. Straight up, I, I that's a whole that. that's a whole that. another point. You keep I, crossing I, I get, points. I no, get what you're no, saying. But though. I'm not saying that nobody. I don't. Like you acting like he can. They don't need each other. He, can, he don't he need can Devin Haney. You acting like Devin Haney is the greatest Devin. fighter in the world. No, like not. you just he team. Is, he is one of the best. He is one of the best fighters in boxing today. I said that you acting like he not. What is you talking about? What is about? you talking about? You talking about need, bro. Bro, he you talking about need. No, to fight don't. Devin Haney. You need to just hang like Devin Haney like, on your wall in your like, living room, bro. Hey, you can say whatever. I, I'm saying say whatever. whatever. We can say whatever. <laughs> I'm saying it's like Floyd Mayweather needed to fight Manny Pacquiao. CBE. Devin Haney. No, he don't. He don't need to fight Tank. Vice versa. No, he don't. Yes, they do. No, he don't. Yes, they do. I said what I said. No, he don't. Whatever you want. No, I'm gonna say whatever I want. You ain't think he needs to fight Pacquiao? It doesn't matter. Huh? You ain't think Floyd needs to fight Pacquiao? No. No. At the time no. that he yeah, fought him, he no, but has, he, he did. He did need yeah, to fight him for did. his resume and for his legacy. And that, and at the end of the day, at the time that he you, did, all no. you fans out there that's like Tony that don't care about no belts and don't care about no legacy, well, okay, ben, bravo. Yeah, about? if you well, don't, ben, if you don't want Tank to fight, if you don't want no, I don't care about uh, that getting loud, aggressive man. Fight, man. You better play that with somebody else, man. He don't need to fight Devin Haney, bro. Tank, he need to fight somebody in his weight division. Is it good for the sport of boxing? Yes, it's good for the sport. And by the way, fans. Obviously, you know that this is my brother right here. We do this all the time. We don't. This ain't nothing. You know, just hey, it's right, all day, every day. You for feel them, me? It's boxing conversation. Yeah, you know, it's boxing conversation. We do this off this camera. Fist of cups and buzz. Yeah, this fist day, of cups and buzz, man. It. We we right. brothers. I'm loving it. But right yeah. now, I'm, yeah, right Corey now, about to go at it now. Let's go, right, Corey. Right now, <laughs> I don't want no smoke. But right now, but right now, I mean, we didn't hear Devin Haney call out Tank Davis a lot, so we know, you know. Javante Davis is a cash cow. He's a pay-per-view star. You don't care about bills. 
You know what I'm saying? He yeah. won the title, won the title, lost the title. You rather have belts than make five million or be a pay per view star? No, you rather have belts, mm. undisputed, make five million. Thank you, thank you, million. man. Mm. Thank you. What were we just saying? But Boxing th- is about dollars. And thank sense. you. This is not what I. Prize this is not fighters. what I created. This I is what the man. sport created. We talk about prize fighting. Duck, or we talk about ducking, legacy, bro. Ducking, Why do y'all try biggest, to cross? But the biggest duck, man. Thing, but the biggest is, duck bro, biggest I can't wait till these guys fight, bro. I can't wait till we get over with. Gonna <laughs> the I swear to God, I swear so I cannot wait till we get past. Look at it out the way. I say Javante Davis is a big duck, but what about Keith Thurman? Everybody like Keith Thurman out the hood. Keith Thurman gonna fight. That's a whole nother plateau. He wasn't gonna fight Earl Spence. He wasn't gonna fight Earl Spence. They not like the reason Tank is coming up is because Tank got. People in his weight class that he not fight. I mean, he never fought. Loma. He the cash cow. He, he do what he want. And I and I get let that. De- let Devin. But, get, but the only thing call, is, that's why we talking about I'm gonna it. tell you the only reason why we talking about this is no. because Devin Haney is in this position right now and he's doing the opposite. So they just thinking <clears> what Devin Haney do or say is law just because he's doing something differently. <laughs> now he's following with the same blueprint, but he's doing what he want, and I I appreciate that. But unlike these people that's making these crazy declarations, I'm just giving you the entire insight of what's going. Going on, Devin Haney has earned his right to be in his position to call these shots. He has earned his right to be in his position to call out these fighters, and, and he, I'm sure he, he can get to come up with the money to make these fights. But he's just doing it his own way, so we can't uh, shy away from these other fighters that did this or you know had this landmark before him, and then mm-hmm. they did it their way. Mm-hmm. That's the only reason why we having these, you know, like these. Cross contaminations or arguments, man, is because he's just doing it his way. The whole purpose was to do it your way. Now we getting fighter, we getting mad at fighters for doing it their way when other fighters decide to do it their way. So yeah, like I say, Devin Haney is a, a one hundred and forty pounder who probably should be fighting at one forty seven. Javante Tank Davis is a one hundred and thirty five pounder Definitely who probably we, he might he could. We could make the argument that he should be fighting at 140 because of his knockout exactly. power. Exactly. But let's, we, he we already still fought can't, at 140. And, he's all, he and already the guy fought. that he fought at 140 is now fighting at 147. That's so what's correct. The, so what's the Arnold difference? Marcus. That's what yeah. I'm saying. Like The we can't, difference y'all is y'all pick the and skill choose. level. Y'all you got a lot of fights. You got oh, Canelo. You got Canelo, <laughs> you got Canelo <laughs> Alvarez that didn't <laughs> fight at bigger weight classes. That don't mean he can fight every fighter at that weight class and dominate. We didn't see that happen. So yes, with Tank, and also you talking about a guy who's five foot five. And matter of fact, don't listen. I don't care about none of that, bro. He's five foot five. Devin is five foot nine. Devin is naturally coming down from a bigger weight. Tank, people just assume that he's just coming down from so much of a larger weight. I just want to see don't, that fight happen. I want to see. Uh, J- and the crazy part about I can't even say this. I was I was about to say that I want to see Javante uh, knock out Devin Haney, but I don't. I, I don't care happen. what happens. You just so sure that it's not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Like Devin Haney is just such a superior <laughs> boxer. Which- All right, guys. All right, we we back, man. We we had to calm down a little bit. Got a little intense. You know what I mean? I yeah. mean, this is these, these are my brothers. You know what I mean? So yeah. it's not it's nothing like that, but. We're good. We're yeah, good. You see, me and Corey, we had see, to split them up. He ain't telling y'all too. It's about to be Ali and Joe Frazier. Right. We had, we had Corey <laughs> had to split them up, man. man. We're good. Yeah, yeah you know. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Afraid. That's why we yeah. sit in the middle scene. And we really <laughs> care. We, 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 we really man. just care about the community so much, man. I we saw. care about our viewers and our subscribers so much, you know, no matter if it's ten, if it matter if it's tens of thousands. We care enough to be, you know, transparent. This is a trans this this show is built on transparency, man. It's built it's built on uh high expectations and uh intense feelings about the sport of boxing, man. That's so right. we, really That's we right. do this for right. y'all. You know, we do that. These are my brothers at the end of the day, man. And and we love to be on the stage with y'all sharing this good uh beautiful. Beautiful boxing information oh, yeah. with the fans, yes, man. Absolutely. So yeah, Indeed. so let's Max. get back to it, man. Yeah. Get back to it. Like yeah, I said, we'll subscribers up too, man. This is yeah. a great yeah. show. Yeah. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Appreciate so like that. we were saying, you know, Devin Haney is the best. <laughs> stop, stop, man. Stop. Hey, we're done with Devin hey, Haney. He's crazy you guys, you for stop. today. Man. My man Tank is not the duck master. <laughs> All right, he's not, man. He's not. He's not, not, not fight, man. but you know what? I think we that fight can be. Oh no, we gonna put it. That Devin Haney and Tank fight can be built up though. It can be make more money. Yeah, absolutely, so, absolutely, very much so. Because he's still gonna happen. But absolutely, this fight with Ryan Garcia and and Devin have to happen to get Ryan out the way. That's the way. So Ooh. to get him okay. out of the way, so they can build okay. up. Because guess what? If okay. he do stop him, if he do stop yeah. him early, he's going to say, "Okay, yeah. I stopped him early. What's up?" Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So it's it's building yeah. up. Just they just have to be patient 
building up. The only person really going to be on the outside knocking in is Shakur Stevens. Unfortunately. Later, because yeah, they ain't going to let him in. No, because he was top they definitely, they're, they're, they're not. It's another they high risk, low reward. Yeah. 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 Heck yeah. They ain't going to let him yeah. in, man. He burnt, he, he, he burnt every that's bridge not, he done had. The only fight he's going to have to really take is Matias if you want to get this big fight. We mentioned that. We mentioned that. We mentioned that. Yeah. I think that would be a big fight. But I mean, it's like this, though. What about the weight, man? Are you going to get Can you. That, your, your first fight coming in the 135, man, wasn't convincing. What? So, I mean, what, you, you, <laughs> you, you, you gonna have to get it. You're going to have to do something, man. You're going to have to show us something. You're well, you know talking about 140. Man, if you get him yeah. in the catch weight. You know what I'm talking saying? Talking about 140. Yeah, get him yeah. in the catch weight. Man, the way, right. they, the way they like. You ain't seen too many catch weights, man. You not, ain't too many. Seen. No, yeah. not too many. That's not too many. Especially because everybody yeah. title chasing, man. You're not yeah. getting a title at a catch weight. That, that, that's that's weight, fact. You know? so, but but that wouldn't be a fight. That wouldn't be a title fight. And then they do a hydration clause in there. So there's no point in having it. You know? But it is. I mean, them, high, them hydration clause, <laughs> it depends on the fight. It yeah, is, like a, Tank and Devin, that high, that fight would dang near have to have a hydration clause. But what's going on? Every fight? Yeah, nah. Devin Haney is a big dude, man. Man, he is. And he's not just big. Big, yes. man. He's, I, his IQ I, is crazy. His skill I, level is crazy. I want to say this fight. He's dangerous, and they know this. I want to say this fight, and then y'all can change the subject. This is a beautiful, this is a great show. Devin Haney versus... We appreciate you, brother. <laughs> appreciate Dev, it, cool. Devin Haney versus Jerron Anus. That Ooh. fight could be made down the line at 40. I think it could, but the, the only thing... It's funny, because we were talking about this we fight. Yeah, we discussed that. Fight. We talking we about this fight. fight. I like this. The only problem is I think Devin does want to clear out... Well, I don't even know if he want to clear out 140, but I think he want to take key fights. Oh, yeah. I think he want T.O. I think he want... Um, but see, uh, yo, he don't need T.O., though. T.O. He, T.O. He don't, T.O. He don't, he don't, he'll be a great fight, He don't need fight, T.O., though, but that's, great a, that's a on his huge resume. But eventually, yeah, yeah, eventually, the champions do need somebody to get to that next level, man, because... Bro, if you're you not gonna get names. up, you're Steel's not gonna get up, up and coming. You're not gonna get an up and coming prospects that opportunity to come get that strap, man. So it's gonna have to be the people whose names already been circulating around the division. To is the name that's circula circulating right. around that division, and I he don't want he don't want that like he think he want that, but. We need, we want it, and, yeah, and Tio is is, is not <laughs> only would be a great legacy fight, but a big money yeah. fight. That's like, yeah. that's and everything. Another bro. thing, man. Let me that's let me say this, for. man. Let me say this, and I'm I'm gonna turn it over to my brothers, man. <clears throat> Y'all inactive fighters that's trying to get in these positions, you can't be fighting once a year. Yeah. You cannot That's be fighting once a year thinking you're going to catch these guys by the coattail, man. No. They Bob. move. You know who was bad at that? You Bob are Bob. not Floyd Mayweather. Who is, it's Landy Lara. Hey. Lara only fight once a Y'all need to be fighting two times, man, a at least year. Three. At least three. You know what I'm saying? For real. Fast. I'm talk, I say at least two. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go two, two. I'm going to go two. But if you can get a third one in there, if you fight That's at the great. beginning if of the year, if you fight, if you fight awesome. at the Money beginning of the year and you dominate, there's no reason you shouldn't be fighting two, three times a year, man. You're not going to catch these guys. And this is the reason. Reason why we keep bringing these same names up, man, yep. is because they're the only ones that's calling our fighters. Yep. They're the only ones in position to make these fights happen. And y'all prospects, you know, whether it's the contracts, the matchmakers, the promoters, so y'all gonna have to start doing some type of lateral movement, man, to get these spots mm -hmm. because these are not the only guys at 140 who really got skill. You got other guys that's coming 135, 140, man, like Richardson, Hitchison. It, oh, it, it's it, you know uh, what I mean? it's some guys, man. Gary Russell, uh, uh, the, the other brother, uh, the, the young brother. Hey, you got some guys, hey, man. So hey, y'all hey, gonna have to start moving better than the why, way y'all moving. Man, why you come with all these facts, man? <laughs> <laughs> man, that's all we that's all we try to come with. That's we either real. coming with facts or we coming with opinions that's backed by strong evidence. You know, exactly. and that's what that's makes what us us, here. man. Exactly. That's what makes us I, us. I, well, I'll be lying on my show. I say Jake Paul versus. You can lie on this one too. You can. You want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can lie on this one. <laughs> nah, I do want to circle back, right? Circle back. So, you know, Tank, he does have a fight coming up June 15th. Yes. Huge fight. Yes. The, the irony, ghost. right, is he was, you know, he's fighting Frank Martin. The irony oh, is Frank man. Martin was originally supposed to fight Shakur ghost. Stevenson, which would have been a great fight, but I think this is a little bit better fight. You know um, what way mean? more money. Way more, more money. money. And guess what? Hey, if you ask me, I think somebody's getting knocked out in this Facts. Place, to be honest. Yeah. Facts. I'm, 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 I'm not going to I'm not going to comment on the fight yeah. because me and Frank Martin and his dad are real tight. So I there we really go. Don't, I really Man, don't Frank Martin, my second cousin <laughs> on my yeah, daddy's side. So really, right, uh, so. No, I'm, I'm <laughs> like, word. <laughs> me, I'm like, like word. Uh, me man. and Frank Martin are really Somebody tight. getting stopped. And Frank really uh, trains hard, man. He trains hard. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He put his body through a lot, but he really going to have to. You, when it comes to tank, you can't make no mistakes. 
That's true. Tank is his IQ, man. And I seen that when he fought Roddy. Yeah. Time it. He a better boxer than people give him credit for, man. Wait, because yeah, because of the way that he has right. to box. You right. know, you get in there with guys like Roley, that's a bigger guy. You get in there with guys like Ryan Garcia, that's a taller fighter. Yep. Possible Devin Haney. These guys are taller fighters. You five foot five, you probably got a sixty something inch reach. These guys seventy two inch reach, five foot nine, five foot ten. The game he plan gonna be a little different, man. He's taking risk, man. He's taking real fighting the ghost, man. And, and he could take you know for he, real. He's taking the huge taking, risk, man. Because we can't we can't overlook Frank Martin. You no, he's you know too elusive, saying? bro. The guy, yeah. you too know, elusive, too fast. Oh, fight man. cut. Hey. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Southpaw. He, he, he looks like bro. what I would want to see in he's my kind, fight. He, Kind of like Tank, bro. Right. Like he is, <laughs> just with a bro. little, probably a little less power. But he a dog. Yeah, he a dog. He, he hunts. He really you. is, man. Yeah. You can't that's say why, he hunts you just like for, Tank. That fight for Shakur. It's a different style. Hey, hey maybe maybe Shakur might have knew something we ain't know. He probably, hey, he did. probably did. No, Tank yeah. ain't no push that wasn't no I mean, walking. Uh, that wasn't no walking. Ain't no park. pushover, bro. He could have made it a walk in the park, and I could, you know, this could just be my, you know, speculation, but. I don't think that was a walk in the park, man. I, yeah. You know, and yeah. yeah, we know Shakur had one of the best def defenses in the uh, in the sport of boxing. We know he has the ability to take probably just, the least punishment in the sport of just, boxing. This is my thing. He ain't been really tested yet to me. Yeah. Being, Which that's one? That's my opinion. Shakur Stevenson. That's my opinion. He ain't I really been tested that. yet. I agree. That's why I'm saying like he ain't nobody really touched. He's that He's so team far yet. ahead of the test though. That's the thing. His mm -hmm. test is gonna be one of them. Yeah, right. That, you know what I'm saying? saying? His test is gonna be. Frank Martin, Shakur, right. I mean, not Shakur, uh, Javante Tank Davis, Devin Haney, Teofimo Lopez, if he was to fight at 140, which, let, you know, let me put an asterisk by that. But this would the, be his test. What about uh, that extra Matisse. weight, though? I agree. I agree. Huh? Yeah. They said Frank put on some extra weight, like some extra muscle. And uh, I want to know if y'all think that it's going to help him <laughs> or hinder him. I think it's going to help him. I think it'll it's going to have to help him. Yeah, because he, he, he already to, hindered. This yeah. Tank Davis. He's going to need to absorb that punishment, man. It's yeah, man. Him. So he he going to. Because he's hey. already a dog, I'm gonna tell you, man. I'm going to tell you another person who's smart out this situation. Who? He can make you some money. Earl. Earl got to make some money off this Oh, yeah. yeah. Being his promoter. Earl, yes, yeah. yes. This is what I'm talking about. Man down. In the wallet. And I don't care what nobody say. That's what I'm saying. Like you said, yeah. our son fighters. Yeah, that's what you fight. See, he got his fighter ready mentally to get ready for fights like this. Which he, he should do as a good as a good umbrella for his yeah. fighters. Exactly. Yeah. And he is Errol Spence. Like, He's been around. He, I'm sure he knows the sport of boxing. He got the money to put the right players in position for, you know, things to work in his favor. Okay. You know, that's a guy that we would love to see back in the ring soon. You 100%. know, yeah, I mean, given, too, given his health, yeah. you yeah. know. Yeah. But I think what he's doing now, he should have did, like, before he fought. I think he should have took some time off, like, some big yeah, time off. Because he came back and fought. Ooh, guys, Only thing back. about that is too much time. Yeah, I think you're Too right. much time in boxing is too much time in boxing, bro. Facts. You, you take too much time off at that age, you know, you some people can't. But, like, by, but can't sure. you just still be in the gym getting, you know, just staying, you know, just staying on top of it? You know yeah, saying? absolutely. But then again, you want to you want to build mu muscle memory. So you got to spar. Okay, okay. Yeah, you know, right, so right, you taking yeah. time off. That's if you're going to spar, you're going to spar more That's rounds. The sparring might be more, the sparring is going to be more rounds than the actual oh fight. God, you sparring two, three times a week. You yeah. might be sparring six to six Can rounds. You got to take that you money when it's available you guys too. Sparring, you guys are nuts. <laughs> I just seen y'all, y'all getting there six, eight rounds. Y'all, 10, 12 round bang, boy. Yeah, that's why it's a hungry uh, man respect. sport, man. It is, man. It's yeah. different you know, levels of sparring too. It, it, it is different levels of sparring. You got work, <clears throat> you got getting worked out. Or yeah. facts. You know what I'm that's saying? a fact. Or I giving facts. the work. I just see some people that come back out that ring, but. Yeah. Nah, man, we all I think been through that. Speaking oh. of, man, that Javante uh and uh oh. Montana love no the no. The, the, Tank oh, versus Devin. Oh, Matter of fact, skip, skip what I was talking Tank about. Devin. And, gotta, the, and it was a young Devin. We know that. It was a, it was a younger ahead, Tank. Young Devin. That's where everybody been hitting my I'm line about. I'm glad you brought it up, go too, because I never got so many texts, emails, phone calls <laughs> from so many people <laughs> oh, man. about boxing in my life until yeah. this came, until this footage came out. I'm glad out. you brought that up, Tony. You know what I mean? Like, we're we going to go ahead and watch this real quick. Oh, my God. Jump in this with us real quick. Hold on.
Yeah. Him being by, he did it could have been a highlight. We don't know. It could have been the highlight. It still was a highlight. I'm going to just say this, man. I see some things where it's like with those things. The reason why I you know, say what I say about Tank, and I'm going to say this. Despite, I mean, even with him being seven, you know, being level 17 or what, um, if Tank is able to give him a shell up and close that distance like that, that's his, that's Devin Haney's greatest attribute in his fight. Or it could, or, or it could be the latter, and he don't get to close that distance. Tank don't get to close that distance. That's why it's kind of hard to. It's it's gonna come down to those two things, man. This is why I agree with you, man, because in the build up, the fight he's getting now is when it's when it's. Oh, okay, <laughs> crazy sparring, yeah, right? Yeah, so hold on, we so we you know obviously we watching this sparring right with y'all. So hold on, the couple points been made. Hold on, Corey, what were you gonna say, man? While we was watching the this? build up, like he like Trump just said, the, that's why we need the build up fight because it's, it's going to see has he mature the maturity because he was only sixteen, he was a kid. So now, but him getting these fights and he's a full grown man now. Let's see the mature Facts. Devin Haney because Facts. we get to see the mature now. But see, Tank is. They both on levels, mm -hmm. but we get to see what what level De Devin has more to prove. Yeah, than Tank does. So we're gonna yeah. see some maturity Agreed. level has and IQ has got better since then. And we know it has. You Wait, know, we know why, it has. Why got more to prove? Huh? Well, I you mean, mean off, Devin off the one of what? Call, calling everybody out, man, well, trying to Devin make the world championship fight. By that clip show, I, like I get that. what he's, he's saying. I get what he's saying. Tank didn't already made everybody believers. Devin's True. still on the fence kind of exactly. with some people that's coming into believing. Like, what? you know, so that I, I I think, you know, if I'm wrong, I apologize, but I'm no. I'm, I'm I'm taking that's what you meant by that. Like Devin mm -hmm. is fresh, a fresh face. Like he's been around right. boxing, but he's a fresh face in terms of dominance, and, in terms and of he went on 24, 23. Yeah, he, uh, because you gotta think, two yeah. of those fights were against yeah. the same guy, you know. And then another fight was against a smaller guy, but it's still Loma Chico. Like we, we I don't know why people just act like he's just not exactly. credible or something. He, like, yeah, no. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And it was exactly, a tough fight. Though. It was a tough fight. a tough fight. So the tough fights That's like show you if a fighter classic. is able to Bro, get through adversity or not. That was a exactly. tough fight for Devin. So exactly. for him to edge that fight the way he did. You know, against a two-time Olympic gold medal, this is three hundred and some amateur fight, he world showed, class world fighter. fighter. Yeah. He, show, he, yeah. showed he, me, showed, he showed. He showed me maturity when he when he took, he took our Regis Pro Games with no problem. He just went there and showed. But like I said, everybody that's said, a boxer and a brawler though. He, right, he would have right. boxed. With I impressed Pro you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to D Haney, yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I yeah, impressed you, huh? If he really won, I think the, the next fight he's gonna get probably the winner between Rolling and Andrew Cruz. I can see that happen. Mm -hmm. Rolling and Cruz. who for who for Devin Haney? I can see that happen. He said Cruz um, too small, man. Yeah, I, I like I I, I'll be honest, it's probably yeah. gonna be that's gonna be a clinic. <clears throat> I feel like that's gonna be a clinic. Big fights man. from here on out. I mean I only big fights. People <laughs> I can see him fighting is you know, like if it was to be a lesser opponent, it'd probably be he'll go to forty seven to fight Barrios. But that's it. Other than that, it's gonna be To. It's gonna be Matias. It's gonna be all the, the <laughs> that, top that, guys. that Barrios yeah. at forty seven. I could see I that. can almost Guarantee that that's gonna happen. Oh yeah, I, I can almost get. Happen. Depending on where Barrios is, by the time Devin Haney moves up to one forty seven, I think Barrios. Gonna, I think Barrios. Gonna, he, he's gonna get his butt to up behind to a Barrios. But I ain't gonna lie. Uh, Devin Haney might go know. up and come back. You know, or, he, he yeah. might go up and come yeah. back. Down. Yeah, especially Devin, if a big if money if fight if is big, there. Yeah, <coughs> fight come Haney, back down. Yeah. Devin Haney versus Conor Ben at forty seven. I don't really want to see that fight, but I think that's a great fight for Devin Haney's profile. International, yeah. too? Yeah. 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 I, I think Tank yeah. can take that fight first before. International? Yeah. I, I mean, I don't think it's a bad fight for any of the I don't. Guys. I was just, just about to, to say that. That's, a, that's actually a good yeah. fight, man. That's a huge you got, fight. That's a name. Yeah. Yeah. That, Conor Ben still has a name. You know, even if his name even mm -hmm. if his, his name isn't that illustrious in the U.S. I, do you think you Anderson you think Anderson take that fight? Who? Conor Ben? And Duran. No. Oh, and it's, yeah. Do you think he should take the? You think nah, he take the fight? No, nah, not for what he's trying to do with his career. Yeah, it that's don't that's make moving sense. back. That's either moving really backwards sense. or staying yeah, stagnant. It, it is man. moving backwards for him. That's but moving I mean, backwards. He had he had get international fans though. But this the know, thing though, true. they at they at. I feel like this man. When it comes to these big fights, somebody name has to be dramatically bigger than the fighter that they want to fight, or they names mm -hmm. got to be equally yoked if it's going to be a big money yeah. fight. 
Jerron Ennis and Connor Ben, they don't them names don't match up in terms of like real I revenue, you know. Yeah. Or now, would you be scared for or the style? Like that's why I think that Barrios fight is actually now, good would fight. Would you be scared for Devin to get up, come up there and fight Terrence Crawford? I ain't scared for nobody to do nothing. <laughs> but I don't. Well, but, no, let me ask. Let me ask you. He, uh, he the big. He the big Devin. He the biggest Devin Haney fan, so I'm gonna ask him. No, oh, bro, I can answer it for him. Yeah, he gonna say, mind. "Yeah, it's a possibility," and then no, I'm playing. But man, Terrence Crawford, man, boy. Terrence Crawford, different. But I, but I ain't gonna lie, Devin is different, man. And it's kind of, you Thank know, you. it's not his fault that he's calling these guys out, and he might, you know, getting his second choice opponents. You know, it's and I get it, I get it because in boxing is unforgiving, bro. You know, we got to start understanding how unforgiving the sport, the fans, the spectators, the, like the, the everybody is unforgiving. It's not it, the 1970s. It, it, you can't have tw- tw- nah. you can't have 85 <coughs> wins and 15 losses and nah. still be a legend and still be a title holder. And you know, Gabriel Rosado put up some of the best performances so I've did, ever man. seen Shout out of the Rosado. One yeah. of my favorites. It's, it's Gabriel just will fight the sport. Will fight. Will fight you, and yes. you know why it's not happening? And he got cheated out of a couple too. To be because honest, the yeah, money, that's neither here nor there, though. Be expected for him and Igor. Berlinger might go at it. The money, yeah. I mean, I am. He gonna fight whoever. He gonna get a check, whatever. He gonna have I think longevity Edgar just Berlinger, because. Edgar yeah, Berlinger is gonna fight, and that's a good fight. That's yeah. a good fight. It, it, the Eric, it, he another one. Edgar Berlinger. He hasn't showed me that he's that he's ready for a Canelo. Now he can fight David Morrell, but. That's another good. You one. You know what I'm saying? But why? I mean, he hasn't showed me that. He's but most ready. of the most of the times. Really this dope. is why I try to get yeah. people to understand. And I'm not saying to try to get y'all to understand because y'all, yeah. you know, y'all yeah. are students of the sport, you know. Right. But I'm saying That's- as far as people, listen, man, it's so many boxers in the sport of boxing. You can't fight everybody. Not to mention you have to nurture your career. You have to nurture your past. Great point. None of these people are going to come help your family get out of financial bonds when Facts. you had the opportunity to put them in position for generational wealth and you let somebody get to your ego in this sport and have you sign up for something that you're not ready for and then you don't get those opportunities. This is not the NBA. This is not the NFL. You're not getting five-year contracts oh, where if you have a losing season then you'll be able to Go bounce fight back next fight. year. If some of these fights, man, is career ending fights. You know, <laughs> yep. man. It, I it, thought it, our it. special guest was here. An- oh, we had another. Man, I didn't even come I back. It was here. <laughs> it's gonna be next time, though. Okay. Next time we got okay. you. Oh, Sorry. I ain't seen you come Sorry, back, bro. Man, but a lot of great points that you guys made. I heard y'all in the back while I was listening. But unfortunately, right? I thought we could surprise the people with something extra here today. Other than our boy, Corey, we appreciate sure, y'all. Man. Thank y'all, man. You know, thank you so much, Corey, for coming up. Oh, thank you, man. Y'all got to come Shout back. Out to you, gotta, Corey. Yeah, I, I love talking to you. And show, you man. welcome anytime, brother. Absolutely. Yes, yes. Absolutely. Yes. And now, of I course. Wanna, I want to oh, see this oh, show. I want to see the show grow a lot. A lot. You you guys, see it. It's already in. It's already you know, in the works. Right? Yes, man. Yeah. It's I, already. I like the fact that y'all not only y'all talk about boxing, but you break it down to the science. Fact. A lot of people don't know fact. science, and I got to tell these fighters today: it's not just about uh. Everybody wants to spar and hit the bag, and hit the pads, but that ain't all of what it's all about. You gotta, sure. get, you gotta get your butt on that floor. Sure. Huh? You gotta learn the craft of boxing. Well, Facts. a lot of these fighters, they they look good on the pads, they get in the ring, you be like. <laughs> Man, I didn't beat some fighters that look like they before the fight they was on the pass looking so good. And I'm kinda like, man, man. I gotta fight I gotta fight him and demolish. You know, it's just you just never know, man. And, and, and the sure. fight can turn at any moment, at any point. And right. you know, styles make fights, styles uh, make fights. Uh, conditioning make fights, yeah. uh, listening to your corner, listen to your team, muscle memory. It's so many things that go into making a fight a great fight, man. And it's you know, we just want to give respect to every fighter that's in the sport of boxing, anybody that could lace up a pair of gloves, knowing what's at stake, especially those who you know they can't, they possibly can't go back to working a job or doing anything of that oh, sort, man. and they able to take yeah. care of their family, man. So we we tip. You know, without y'all, is is no us. It's no fist cuffs, no fist cuffs and buffs, man. And you know, nice. our special guests is none, none of this will be possible. So we really just this is how much we love the sport of boxing, man. This is why we come together to do what we do to bring to you guys what we bring to you every month or so, man. So just hey, stay locked in. You know, keep those hands up, man. And 
Facts. Let's oh. get it cracking, man. <laughs> Thank you. And stand and stay away from the standing eight count. Facts. <laughs> Facts. Facts. No cap. Uh, yeah. Shout out to the MKU Network. Yeah, shout, shout out, out. to uh, Takers Gaming Lounge. Yes, sir. Shout out. Shout out to our guy Corey, man. Shout Laid back sure, Corey, man. Corey, Coming man. through Happy the rock bro. Seriously, Thank you bro. so much. Man. Thank appreciate you, man. You, man. Yeah. Um, and obviously, shout out to the world of boxing. Keep rocking with us here at Fist of Cups and Buffs. Yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Look out for us because we come yes, in, man. Hey, tell them what y'all. they got to do, brother. Man, tell them what yeah, they got to yeah, do, man. man. Take keep liking, subscribing, and keep following us, all right? Keep those hands up. It's Fist of Cups and Buffs. Let's, Let's get, get it. it. Man. I'll be man. Make sure <laughs> that episode.